What is up, viewer out there watching this video? Like Rocks back here, bringing you this time another NHL 18 simulation. It's been a while since I've done one of these, but in this video, we're going to be doing basically the same thing as all the other ones. This time, we're taking the Vancouver Canucks once again. Yes, it's usually the Vancouver Canucks, but this time, it's just the normal team. It's the normal 17-18 Canucks roster, but with three new acquisitions. The three players that we added to this team are 99 overall Tom Sestito, 99 overall Jason Magna, and 99 overall Lucas Spiza. Seeing as these three guys weren't in the NHL last season, I know Spiza was, but Spiza basically didn't play. Magna and Sestito are both AHL guys, so we decided to bring them back on one-year deals with 99 overall stats to see how they would be able to take this team forward. Our three 99 overall players in Tom Sestito, Jason Magna, and Lucas Spiza enough to bring the Stanley Cup back to Vancouver for the first time in 100 years. Can the Canucks win a Stanley Cup with this roster? Everything else is the same. The goaltenders, that's the same too. The scratch lines, we got a whole bunch of guys over here that are still scratched. And we just have so many forwards that aren't playing. Because, you know, we have too many forwards, even with these two guys. Because, you know, Leipzig's not on the team. Mott's not on the team. Goldolbin, Boucher, these guys aren't on the team. It's just... This. This is what we have. This is what we're going to go forward with. Sestito, Megna, and Besser. I'm expecting great things out of this line. And then on defense, Spiza is going to be paired with Tanev. So let's go over to the simulation here, and we'll see how things are able to stack up against the rest of the NHL. Let's go down over here to April, April the 8th, and I'll see you guys on the other side. And we are back, guys. Right away, we can see 109 points for the Vancouver Canucks, 52, 25, and 5. Definitely a better record than what we had in real life. And checking things up on the score sheet, Jason Megna is a 94-point player. Taking a look at things, this is pretty good. Wow, okay then. This is amazing, actually. That's incredible. Besser with 32, 51, and 83 points, so he's over a point per game. This is the same amount of points that Barzal got, so, ha, all it took for Besser to beat Barzal was to get a Spiza, Sestito, and a Megna on a team, and have them each at 99 overall. Spiza, defenseman, 24 goals, 85 points. Sestito, 38 goals, 89 points, that's amazing. Jason Magna with 94 points here, definitely one of the better players in the NHL, if I do say so myself. But he doesn't get the Art Ross, that goes over to Alexander Ovechkin, who will most likely get the Maurice Richard as well. Magna and Sestito are top 5 players in the league, Lucas Spiza is obviously going to be the Norris winner. Brock Besser, most likely going to be the Calder winner as well, seeing as there are no Matthew Barzals in sight anywhere. So this is all good. Tom Sestito was able to lead the team alongside of Megna and Spiza to a 100 and however many points seasons. So 109, that's, my math was wrong earlier, I said 107 I believe. So... Checking things out with the entire league, let's see how they stack up. Goals for, are we first? Yes, we are. Goals against, are we first? No, we are not. But we are close to first. We are down here at seventh, tied for seventh, with three other teams, or two other teams, my my excuses. But, yeah, this is cool. This is cool. Um, We got ourselves a good team here, guys, and going into the playoffs, we clinched the Western Conference... Uh, what do we look like in the rest of the league? We won the President's Trophy. Wow, my goodness. Okay, so that's great. So, all it took for the Canucks to be back on top of the league was Jason Magna, Tom Sestito, and Luca Spiza. Let's go over to the playoffs here, and we will simulate our way through here. Let's go over to... Okay, the first round is against the LA Kings. And simulating the first few games, there's a win. There is a win. There is a win. There's a win! Alright, so we swept the LA Kings in the first round. This is the first time since 2011 that the Vancouver Canucks are in the second round of the playoffs. Yeah. 
It's really sad. Let's go over to game 5 here against the San Jose Sharks. And starting things off, there's a loss, there's a loss, there's a win. Come on, get another win. There we go, it's a win. It's a tie series right here. Alright, let's simulate this game right here, game 5. Let's do this one, simulate the periods. 3, okay, yeah, we got this one in the bag. 7-4 to four victory over the San Jose Sharks. And taking a look at the playoffs, yes, 5 points for Tom Sestito, 4 for Magna and Besser. That is great. Alright. I like what I'm seeing. Let's go over to game 7, because if we win game 6, then it's all good. There we go, we won game 6, we're now in the third round. Simulating over here, we're against the Nashville Predators. Let's go over to game 4. Alright, starting things off, there's a loss, there's a win, there's a loss. Okay, we kinda need a win here, so let's slow sim this one over here. Alright, there's a 1-0 lead, there's a 1-1 one -one game. And we got it! Three goals in the third period, Sacito, Sutter, and Sedin. The three S's getting things done right here. Alright, we are now up. Or not up, we're tied. Right, alright, let's go over here to game five, and we will simulate this one the same way. Alright, going over here, game five in Vancouver. A five-nothing lead going into the second period. Incredible performance, guys. Great, five goals in the pers in the first period. That's a, that's awesome. Absolutely awesome. Three points for Magna and Luca Spiza, and we're up in the series. Let's simulate over to game seven right here. If we win game six, then it's all good, but we didn't. Okay, we are now here at game seven in Vancouver. We'll simulate our way through. First period, 3-1 Vancouver. Okay, that's great. 3-1. Second period, 4 to 2. Third period, 5 to 3. Tom Sestito seals the deal for the Vancouver Canucks. Two points for him, one goal for Jason Megna, and things are looking great as the Vancouver Canucks go off to the Stanley Cup Finals. Let's go over here against the Buffalo Sabres. All right. We will um how do I want to simulate this? Let's see. Let's simulate the first game first, just a normal sim. And we'll do the same thing, skim through all the periods, 1-0, 3-0, 3-1, alright, that was great, we're up 1-0 in the finals, let's simulate over to game number 4, there's an L and a dub, alright, we're here at game 4, it's a 2-1 series lead for the Vancouver Canucks, let's see what things happen here in Buffalo, 1-0 Buffalo, 4-1 Vancouver, 5-1 Vancouver, okay, that is great, we have a stranglehold here on the series as we are up 3-1 to one in the Stanley Cup Finals, knowing the Vancouver Canucks were probably going to lose, but let's just, let's just take things a game at a time here. Go over to game number 5. Let's quick sim this one as well. First period, it is 2-1. to one. Second period, it is 4-1. to one. The Vancouver Canucks at home in Rogers Arena will most likely be walking away with the Stanley- No, 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 why did I say that sentence? Why did I start saying that? They started scoring goals. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. Hold it out, guys. There we go. Brock Besser. Brock freaking Besser. 43 shots. Let's simulate. And we will go over to the very end so we can see the Vancouver Canucks lifting the Stanley Cup. Okay, 15 seconds left. Let's go over here. Man, this is awesome. The Vancouver Canucks are going to be winning the Stanley Cup off of the hands of Tom Sestito, Jason Magna, and Luca Spiza. These three 99 overall players added to the Vancouver Canucks allowed the team to succeed. And that is definite. That is totally undisputable at this moment, as there are 17 seconds left to go in Game 5 of the Stanley Cup Finals, and the Vancouver Canucks have a 5-2 lead. Get the first line out there. Let's go, guys. Here we go. Pass it up. No, 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 no. Here we go. Tom Sestito, once again, coming down the wing. Four seconds left. He can't bury it at the end of the game. In front to Megna, and it's okay, because the Vancouver Canucks are still able to pull away with the victory. Heck yes, boys, all it took was 399 overall players, and the Vancouver Canucks finally get themselves a win here in these NHL 18 simulations, because, let's face it, every one of these simulations I've done, they've not worked. 
None of them have worked other than the freaking Soviet Union team, and that wasn't a Canucks team. This was the first Canucks team to actually make it all the way through. Let's go over, simulate all the way to the very end here, and we will... Yeah, okay, three points for Tom Sestito. We will go over later through all the awards and we'll see who impacted our team in the best ways possible. What a great run, guys. Fantastic. I'm snapping my fingers for that one. Great run right here. Let's simulate a day ahead and we'll look at the awards. All right, simulate up to here. Okay, there we go. The Marlies won the Calder Cup. Okay, that's realistic. Jesus, they did that in real life. Okay, Tom Sestito with 36 points and 22 playoff games. My gosh, what a beast. An absolute monster of a player. Stanley Cup, Vancouver Canucks. Okay, we got all of these. President's Trophy and the Clarence S. Campbell. If we go over to player awards, Art Ross, Ovechkin. Hart, it might be one of our guys or it might be Ovechkin. It's Jason freaking Magna. Yeah, Jason Magna wins the Hart Trophy for the first time ever. That's great. He's the next player after McDavid to win it. So, yeah. Going over to the Norris, this one better be Spiza. And it is Spiza. Okay, Lady Bing. Brock Besser. Okay, I like that. Calder. Brock Besser. Con Smythe. Tom Sestito. Yes. Vesna. Totally not our guy. Jennings. Totally not our guy. Masterton. Nate Schmidt. Selkie. Wow. Jason Magna wins the Selkie. Ted Lindsay. This one also goes to Jason Magna, Maurice Bouchard, Ovechkin. Okay, so we got a lot of awards. Magna got the heart as well as the Lindsay. Sestito got himself the Con Smythe. Besser got the Calder and the Lady Bing. And Spiza got the Norris. This is what happens, folks, when you add two, three, 99 overall players to your team. They get points and they get awards. Congratulations to Jason Magna, Tom Sestito, and Lucas Pisa for leading this team to a Stanley Cup. Hope you guys enjoyed this video for Plus, and this is Rolls Gaming, and bye. <laughs>